sword and shield. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, I wasn't expecting a doom. This one has a sword and shield as well. Doom. We're gonna tempt your tummy with the 21 months of subby. It's a bog on a TV show on Twitch TV, you know. Catterly, thanks for the 21 months. You're amazing. Okay, so let's see, what else, what else is over here? This is, let the righteous find their wisdom and the wise their reward. Okay, so two bing bongs. This one is a male angel holding a sword. This one is female angel holding a hammer. Wait, can I just have one person walk around? Thank you. Holding a sword. All right, so anything with a sword, maybe? Sword good, everything else bad? And they all reset at this point. Close them. Doom, doom. Now I can just make a song. All right. Um. May the holy angels abide with us. The hand of the inheritor who makes thy will known and the silver twins. Okay, so that's the two angels. The hand of the inheritor. And then this. Scepter and the orb are hollow. Okay, there's no scepter or orb. The shield and sword. Huh. Alcat says, for this puzzle, you can skip clues and go with your ear. Okay. Go with my ear. How it sounds. Uh-oh. That's two of them lit up. That's three of them lit up, right? Oh, it's four or five. Oh, they're all almost lit up. Okay, let's do this one. No, and then they all shut off. So if you do the whole, if you do the whole thing in the wrong order, they all shut off. Okay. I like the way the first one sounded. Doom. Doom. Okay. You want it to keep like going up, right? Ding. No, see that went down. Which one's the lowest? Okay. Which one's, which one? Guide us. Which one's the lowest over here? Okay, so I think it's like... Okay, that was last, I think. Um, all right, let's try this. Don't... Speed. No, no, no. 
No. Turn them all off. Okay, it's this. Then here. No. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Uh, okay. And our friends are like on the in the lobby, like dying to demon hordes right now. You know? Oh, I can't remember now. No. Sugar plum fairies. Okay, that one. No. If you mess up, do you have to start all over? Which one? Middle one? I can't remember. Middle and then this one, right? If you zoom out, you should be able to see them all on screen. What? How does that help me? It was just bothering you, I bet. <laughs> um... Yes! All right, we did it. All right, that was pretty cool. So wait, can you do that without listening? Is there clues that get you to do that without listening? Yeah. So I was reading those books. How does the book get you the clue? Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, we found it. We did it. Save. You think it's in a note? A note that I found or haven't found yet? Maybe, I think you have to do, you probably have to find more of these sermon extracts and it'll kind of tell you what the order is maybe. I don't know. Let's see, what do we got? We got two spears. Okay. We got a heavy shield, a cold iron long spear, and a great ax. Ooh, a magic flail. A flail of light burst. I like how so many of the magic items that you find in this aren't just like plus one weapons. They give you like little extra things that, you know, and they're not all of them are super powerful or anything, but they just do like little bonuses here and there. I love that. And this is a spiked heavy shield. Interesting. Sila has just a normal heavy shield, right? Well, she's got a cultist heavy shield, which she probably shouldn't be wearing for RP reasons. Yeah, that was pretty cool. In the offhand. Oh, you need two. Oh, is this two weapon fighting though? That's considered two weapon fighting, just having that equipped. Uh, okay. Flail of Light Burst is a plus one flail. Whenever this plus one flail confirms a critical hit, it deals 1d6 positive energy. Okay, she's using Icebreaker right now. I think Icebreaker's a little better. Yeah. Yes, it's a weapon. Okay. But just having it equipped, I can't, I can't have this equipped and not two weapon fight. I guess that's what I'm asking. Plus one buckler. I didn't even know. This is a 25 AC. Oh, her old shield is also 25. I'll just keep it. Yeah. She's, the game's literally telling me, uh, you just did something that's gonna hurt you. 
three more long spears. Okay. Another masterwork. Cold iron spear. Cold iron heavy flail. We found the hidden armory gang. Ooh, look at this one. Tower shield. Magical falchion. Cold iron falchion plus one. All right, so the tower shield. She can't even use it. You have to be like a... You have to have special proficiency for that, right? Sneaky food thief says, my dude, how did you install more character portraits? Um, you can just Google it. Just Google how do you install portraits on it? I'm not going to be able to explain it to you. You basically have to just uh, have three different versions of a picture into a specific file on your uh, a specific folder on your hard drive and there's uh there's like portrait packs that you can download people have like compiled hundreds of portraits together and you can just unzip them all onto the specific folder and then you can access them yeah it's pretty cool it's pretty cool you're welcome sneaky food thief it's not too hard you can do it um scroll of holy Sir sword for holy water. Oh, snap! I got leather barding for a bucket. Nice. 10 cure moderate. That's worth 3,000 gold right there. And the amulet of agile fists. Okay, first of all. Hell yeah. This is worth 1,000 gold. So this plus one leather barding increases animal companions base speed by 10 feet and grants it one additional attack for opportunity. What? Yeah, Alcat, that's that's the link I use to get my character portrait. Yeah, that notra.fr uh, portrait. You can take any picture and it will resize it for you into the uh, the sizes you need. Yeah, thanks for linking that. All right, let's see what it looks like when we put it on them. I love that you can level up and equip horses. Nice. So what did it, what did the armor class go from? 21 to 24. That's insane. That's awesome. I really can't wait to get glasses for the horse. I want to wear I want sunglasses on Bucket. Bucket needs sunglasses. <laughs> All right, it even has it there too. Wow, so much work went into this game. Okay, that's fun. Let's um, let's look at all of our stuff. Newest to oldest. This amulet, agile fists. If the wearer has the weapon finessed feet, this amulet allows her to apply her dex modifier in place of strength to damage rolls with all unarmed and natural weapon attacks. Uh, can he, he can wear a necklace, right? I don't think you want to do that though, right? You don't want to do dex instead of strength because the horse is just super strong. I have, I don't think I have anybody that would use that, right? Yeah. You come back and I have a horse? Has he punched yet? No, but I, I was close to naming it Punching Bag, Marauder. I was this close. This close. Yeah. Wolgif? Maybe use it on the horse? I don't think it's, it's good on the horse because it's going to use dex modifiers instead of strength and... You want to use the strength on the horse. How'd you get the horse? At level five, Sila gets to choose between getting a horse or getting divine bond on her weapon. And I went horse. And the horse like 
crushes things. It <laughs> attacks three times around, charges across the battlefield. It's insane. Love it. Wolves just should have low strength and weapon, but it's an unarmed attacks. It's only unarmed and natural weapon attacks. Hmm. Did you have that option and missed it? Probably, but you have it set to, uh, you have it set to auto level. Probably. Yeah. It's, it's literally a choice you have at level five. I didn't even know that was there. I was surprised. I didn't know that was a feature of Paladin in this. I bit my lip and I made it bleed. Okay. What else did we get? I don't think I can make use of the Agile Fist, unfortunately. Uh, Scroll of Holy Sword? She can have that there. Why not? Potions of Holy Water? Maybe she can throw that on some undead or something at some point. Cold Iron Falchion? I don't think I need... Okay. We got a lot of loot right there. Flail of Light Burst. I don't... Anything else that I'm missing that I should have equipped? I don't think so. I can't believe we found our horse treasure, though. Lightened Harness. Very neat. All right, let's save it. From what, from what I hear though, I mean, I'm, I, the horse is powerful, um, but I, I think Divine Bond is good too. You can change her, like, I almost chose that. She could change, like, what kind of damage her weapon does, like, at will to get around resistances and stuff, right? All right, uh... So we conquered this room and this leads back to where we were. Okay, I think, I think we're done with this level. Yeah, there's no way I can get like, well, I can get over here, but this is all blocked. All right, so we have to go to the basement. No, to the second floor is where we need to go. And we can get up there. In different ways. This is where we came in, right here from the basement. Alright, let's go to the second floor, but from here. Because this was like a secret way. We, we move this bookcase to open it. So hopefully that'll give us some sort of tactical advantage when we go to the next level. I don't know. I'm just making this up. <laughs> I'm just making it all up. How did Bucket go up the stairs? We don't know. Surprise! Oh, nice! How funny is that? And that guy, how did he win initiative? I surprised you guys with the secret lever. All right, this is a sheer, a brimarack. Have I fought them before? I don't know. Okay, Wolgif goes, but then all the bad guys go. I'm gonna delay his turn. No, I'm gonna just buff him. With a mutagen. Wolgif. Using his alchemy level. His alchemist level. It's a great effect. Alright, move up a tiny bit. Did they just fireball? He fireballed the entire room. Oh my god, and he killed my Crusader wizard. 
guy just fireballed. Another shear bites the dust to Ember. Make every strike count. <laughs> or not. Um. Charge. Bite him, horse. Oh no, who's this wiggler? Cleric. Strike as one. Okay. 23. Not so bad. Not too shabby. This cleric's annoying. Uh, what do we want to do with him? Let's get in there. Wolchiff. Time to share your treasures. This will leave a bruise. What did he do that time? Breath weapon? Okay, Sila is about to die. I want this cleric to go down. Nope, no can do. It's no fun when the enemy can play with fire also. I know. That's exactly what I was thinking. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. Okay, Sila. The light take you. Nice. All right, the boomerang's, the boomerang's dead. I'm all right. Hello. Oh, nice. The charge trip worked. All right, let's move uh, Darren into the middle of everybody and do a heal. Eight. Well, it's better than none. Cover me, all right? Duh! Knocking everybody down. You won't survive me. Okay, Sila. Over there and wait. Okay, that guy died. Bring him over before we wake the shear up. He's still sleeping, and now we can wake him up. I'll hit you. Endure this. Your performance is lacking. Thirty-four damage there. Nice. Okay. And here I thought I was gonna surprise him through the secret door, and like get this huge advantage all we did was pack everybody into this tight space and the guy just went fireball <laughs> i thought i thought it was so smart adriana what's going on thanks for following all right let's get the loots scroll of bless okay 
Okay. Some interesting things. Summon monster. Masterwork scythe. By the way, we're medium encumbered. I forgot about that. Okay. Um, what's my heaviest stuff? Oh, that tower shield is monstrous. And what does it sell for? Seven? Okay, so we drop that. Boop. And we don't need that. And we don't need that. Boop, boop. These sell for 18. Drop. That one sells for 100. Hold on to that one. Okay. How did I get an... Oh, that's the one I... That's the one I carried. All right, never mind. <laughs> like, why did I keep putting heads in my inventory? Stop doing that. Okay. Knowledge World DLC 24... Uh, DC 24? Just don't blame me. I'm gonna blame you. Try again. Did I just glance over to see you carrying a severed head? Yes, you didn't. You you weren't here when I discovered that. Did you see that? Do you, it's probably it's probably better if I don't spoil it for you. Just don't blame me. You might get there one of these days. <laughs> you ask me. He's rolling bad. Just don't blame me. What do you need? He sees 24. It's plus 12, right? You just need a 12. It's statistically unlikely that he'll fail again, right? You ask me. Come on. You rolled a six. How many times is that? Four? Or five? You ask me. Come on. You rolled a six again. Jeez. They don't let me save scum. Let me save scum. Just don't blame me. Is it going to be a six every time? Wait. Can't be a six every time, right? No, I rolled a two before. Okay. <laughs> Jeez, you roll the two and three over and over and over again. I'm going to mix things up. Here we go. Move everybody over here. Get out of his way a little bit. Save. You ask me. Oh, my God. Hey, I rolled a four. At least it's something different. There's just no way. It, it was a change that made me feel a little better. It's gonna be like there's a book on the table with stuff on it. You ask me. Another six. You can cast guidance on him. Oh yeah. That's a good print. Who's got ask guidance? Nicely. I don't know what it looks like, though. Is that a clerical thing? Rules are made to be broken. There we go. I 
Don't mind me. Save. This is my kind of work. There we go. First try. These strategic maps offer many intriguing details about the movements of the Crusader army, but they are too numerous to list here for you right now. No, just kidding. Uh, the demons must have thoroughly studied them before destroying them with their claws and spattering them with blood. That's what it was? It was the 24 experience. You're right. That's, that's the real prize there. Holy cow. I feel older. Yes. worth okay i know it's four o'clock and i usually leave but let's just go a little bit more a little bit more godspeed i'm a faltered it's not a hooked faltered though which is entirely different myth lakes oh that's the loot i dropped okay i think So we're up here. Oh, okay. We've already have part of this done. Hello. Let us press on. I won't let you hurt my Babu. Friends. There's a Babu. Ooh. You sneak attacked Ember. She was very vulnerable. Babu are the crazy ones with the glaives, right? Barb demons. Hey, Ali, what's going on? Just want to say thank you for uploading the highlights, Bog. They're so good. Thank you. It's all Rose Wolf. Rose Wolf does all that for us. You hope Peachy doesn't see you kicking a dog off a cliff, though? I didn't kick a dog off a cliff. I don't know what you're watching. I didn't do that. Okay, wolf. I, I didn't kick a wolf off either. I pushed it. I shoved. Hey, Zooty, what's up? Yeah. And it was a very dangerous wolf. Gotta add that part in. All right, well. Heal. Why do I even have this wizard with me? That's a huge fight. And it's not it's not pleasant. Let's go attack. Cover me, alright? Zero damage. Uh oh. Oh, shnikes. Really? You're too far? Go here. Nasty Mac. Thank you. Well, why that wasn't working? You've crossed the wrong mantra. 34 crit that? that was great i did see it you're amazing we're gonna take an attack of opportunity for doing this go for it I found something. babu hits bucket with bite sneak attack uh-oh is bucket almost dead oh bucket is dead she's gonna oh the reason why he does she doesn't fall immediately off Cause I, I took a trait. Um, I took a trait. Die hard. So when it goes below zero, it waits till you can fight one more round. 
So if I heal it, it won't fall down and dump seal it to the ground. Okay. I have no idea if this is going to work or not. I'm going to try. Go to sleep. Okay. Should have expected that outcome. Good job, Wolgif. Dodging. Dodging that stuff. Can I get them in the cure? Yeah, I think so. Yes, Bucket got healed. Bucket won't go down. That's why he died mysteriously the other time. Yes, yes, I just figured it out. What would seal his mobility when you're a mounted comet? What do you mean? Like, how do you want that answer? She's very mobile. She, she goes way faster. Why not both? When it's her turn, I'll look and see if uh, it tells me. Mobility is the skill. And when are you getting the feet mounted combat? I don't know if I'm getting any of that. We'll see. I have no idea. Strike as one. I didn't even know she was going to get a mount until I was leveling her up to five. You won't survive me. Oh, land. Come on, land. One damage. Her speed is 50. I don't know if that's what you were asking or not. Like she can she could go all the way like here and still attack. Like, it's ridiculous. She's hasted right now, so that that affects it, but yeah. 50 is her speed. Into the fray. <laughs> Ow. Stop biting me. So he's like resistant to fire and everything. Okay. Um, can you bone shaker, bone shaker, maybe? There you go. 18. Nice. The horse is going to go down again. Distract them from me. Nice. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Long spears. I think I picked up long spears, which are probably heavy and don't sell well. Yeah, they're nine pounds. Drop. Cold iron, I'll take. So no kobold in this game? No. What do you mean? You can't be a kobold if that's what you're asking. Mounted combat makes it so when you mount, when your mount gets hit, you roll mobility to negate the attack. Really helps with survivability of your animal companion if you're going to be mounted. Ah, okay. Are they in it? I haven't seen a kobold yet. There's plenty of kobolds in Kingmaker. If you like kobolds, Kingmaker is your game. <laughs> hey, Danimal, what's up? Okay, so mounted combat makes it so when you mm -hmm. mount gets hit, you roll mobility to oh right. mo her mobility yeah, skill. Us. It's terrible. It's three. She has the bare minimum to get the bonus for defensive uh, attacking. Yeah, or it's 
Well, it's ranks three. It's minus four total. <laughs> yeah. But I chose the tanky horse. You know, uh, I chose Bulwark. I gave it the, uh, the skill I was just talking about, but also I gave it die hard and toughness. And we just found that magical barding. So hopefully that helps keep it up. Your wolf is a bully. Bully with the trip is a really good idea. Anything that trips is ridiculous in this game. Just causing the trip and then you surround them to do the uh, attacks of opportunity. My tail is restless. Might be trap, might be treasure. Pretty good, aren't I? Yeah, you're pretty good. Loot here? Oh. Potion of Shield of Fate just sitting there in the, in the swamp, in the gutter. All right, so this trap comes from this door. There's many ways to go. Let's make him, um... Something wrong. Watch and learn. Stealthy. It's so funny when a 15-foot demon falls over. I love that. That's my favorite thing about 15-foot demons. Can we retreat already? Speaking of 15-foot demons... Uh-oh! Wolja fails to sneak while his party is all over here. All right. Hold on. Yeah, retreat. Exactly. Dodge is good for AC. It's odd, but you could also do crane style. You could do crane style on the horse. <laughs> crane technique. I love it. Um, okay. No, no, no. Stop every ah, stop everybody. What's the key to stop? G? Okay. G is Don't mind me. Goldmancy helped me with a ton with that. If your party is like moving out of control, just hit G. Wait, aren't they hitting their own trap? What the hell is this? The Minotaur says I will love him and hug him and call him George. Yes. Um. Is I healed up enough? Do they have feather step? I don't know. Did I ring the dinner bell? When I touched this door, it totally rang the dinner bell. And we know what's in there, too. take an attack of opportunity here? I don't know. Um, these guys all have damage reduction to elements. Oh, I see the bard back there. Yeah.
The bard song's over. Yeah, that's the disadvantage of having her mounted is like instead of spending their attacks on her giant AC, they're all trying to hit bucket and then she'll get dumped off bucket and have to and she'll be prone. That's the disadvantage. And what's bucket's health at? Oh, bucket's already down minus 13. Can she dismount before the whole thing falls? I would assume so. Smite good. Okay, there. Am I going to trigger this trap? Signs say yes. Cleave to kill two dretch. Stab you or zap you. Why not both? That guy casts Ray of Frost every turn. All right, she was able to stand up. The inheritor, guide my blade. Okay, land. You won't survive me. Gotta kill this Minotaur. So we know what he is. Just a Minotaur? No, he's gotta be some sort of fiendish something or other. He's got all these resistances. Let's shake his bones. Actually, can I put him to sleep? <laughs> My go-to? Go to sleep. <laughs> that spell is so ridiculous. And pretty much like every major enemy we faced has been put to sleep by her. It is uh, a little, little ridiculous. It's so useful. It is. It is. I guess we'll cleave again. Actually, we don't have to cleave. We can attack twice. Strike as one. There we go. Distract them for me. Don't hit the guy that's sleeping. Did that wake him up? It might have woke him up. Just smack him. Oh, that trap is gonna. Don't loot. Did that? I just spent her turn looting. Probably. Endure this. Uh, he did wake up. Attack. Time to share your treasures. I don't think he's gonna surrender. All right, nobody move. I said nobody move. Wolder. Ask nicely. 
Might be trap, might be treasure. This is my kind okay. of Okay. Sweet. This war must end. What do we got for loot? A scimitar. Composite short bow, masterwork scimitar. Composite long bow, scimitar. Scimitar. Minotaur just had a great axe. Long spears, masterwork kukri. Lots of spears. Can I ask a question? I have a question. Why is this long spear nine pounds and worth one gold, and this one is nine pounds worth 18 gold? No questions allowed, Edot? Are you sure? Hey, Playtown, how you doing? Not that it matters, but I don't know why some long spears are uh, worth money and some aren't. Yes, you have to sit there, be quiet, eat your vegetables, and play your video game. Okay, I'm sorry. One's crap craftsmanship, and the other has never been used. Oh, okay. Meditate on your mistakes. And yet it's you not masterwork. It Alright, that was a little bit of a crazy you fight. The wrong mongrel. That was a crazy fight. Gang, uh, we're going to be wrapping up uh, in a minute or two here. But um, just to let you know, tomorrow I'm making good on my promise of uh, playing one stream of Final Fantasy VII Remake as part of the Overlooked Games uh, event we did last month. So tune in tomorrow if you want to see me play the first Final Fantasy game in like 10 it years. A gift, I don't know. A gift to the friends of the otters. Playtown just gifted a sub to Eda. Thank you, Playtown. Thank you very much. 134 gifted subs for Playtown. Wow, the loot in this, this was not a fan. Th that was a very challenging fight with traps for almost no reward. Unless there's something hiding here that I'm just not aware of. Might be a good room to rest in. Godspeed. I don't know if you're allowed to rest during the whole thing, are you? I guess you could. We're just going to rest 19 hours where when uh, Tirabade is in the lobby fighting. Do they let you rest during this? I would. It would be cool if they didn't. Need a key. I like that there's a dinner bell there. Okay, that's where we're going to be getting to. This actually doesn't help us, does it? No. It should let you rest, but have the fight resolve by the time you get there. That's true. Hey, who's dragged all these barrels in here? Stop. You can't come in here. I was ordered to ring out. Yes. Aha, uh -huh, fine trick. Keep it up and I might invite you to join our club. Who's that guy? Mysterious stranger. That was amazing. Laugh out loud. I didn't do that. What do you mean? You did? What happened for you? That was great. Oh, if maybe if you come in from this way, it doesn't happen. I don't know. I don't know. You walked in there and had to kill those guys. I wonder what I did to trigger the mysterious stranger. Doormat, thanks for following. Hey, free loot. John Zorb, it's from an early chore choice. Oh yeah? 
Do you know what choice it was, just for anyone watching? Half plate. It's worth 150. Oh, the trickster stuff. You sent them to burn down the other library. Oh, okay. Got it. You didn't do the trickster path because you were dumb? Not because you were dumb. You just didn't want to. Uh, Chekak says, hey, I'm from Steam. Looks like a wonderful game. Which which game were you watching on Steam? Yeah, I have. A, there's a couple games uh, that I've done streams for the developers and they put the uh the vod running on steam oh you thought the mythic path options would lock you in okay gotcha yeah no it's worded poorly iron danger oh really they have me still running on iron danger wow nice yeah it's a fun game yeah but welcome to the stream check um, okay. Let's grab this. Wait, I don't know what this is. Magical Warhammer? It's called The Collapse. Yeah, for once it wasn't Witchet. You're right. It's usually Witchet or Unrailed. Those are the two most popular ones that we get folks coming in to check out the stream for. All right, um, I got to loot all those things and didn't even have to fight it. That was great. It was the oldest. Here's the Warhammer, the Collapse. It's a plus one cold iron Warhammer. And when it confirms a crit, all enemies at 15 feet must pass a fortitude saving though DC 16 or become prone. Wow. It's actually a pretty big area, pretty decently high DC. Huh. But I have no use for a plus one Warhammer. Zero. I think Icebreaker is still better. 3d6 cold. All creatures in a 10 foot area taking 3d6 cold. <laughs> Way better. Hey, Hoppy the Fool. You munching on popcorn? It's bludgeon damage, true. Unless things are probably resistant to it. That is true. All right, let's see what's here. The sacred image depicts a man dressed in a robe holding a wand. The inscription reads, Zacharias of Canabras, the Holy Martyr. Okay. Okay, getting closer there. And there's another ward. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get through that because they killed all my mages. Pick the lock 10% chance. Well, we can reload that over and over again. I have to wrap up though, gang. This will work for a shot though. Just don't blame me. Oh, this guy can do it. Oh, I didn't realize I still had a wizard. Nice. I thought all my wizards died. All the random wizards. Oh, nice. Dwarven War Axe, why do you keep giving me these exotics? Scroll of Stone Skin. Wooden spoons! Did you know slotted spoons don't hold much soup? Yeah. Alright, um... Mordant War Axe. It deals 1d3 acid damage. Okay. Sells, sells nice. Wow, 
Why do I have a pony? Um, it's from Sila. Sila, when she turns level five as a paladin, she can choose either divine bond for her weapon or to get a horse. So I chose a bloody, it's a bloody horse bucket. All right. I am going to save it there. This was awesome. I love this whole dungeon. It's been a lot of fun.